Hello beautiful soul, be still and know I am God. We are in this beautiful park. I'm uh, working out a bit, moving this human body, this avatar. <laughs> of course you have to remind yourselves uh, in this uh, time and space that uh, you are not the body, you are consciousness. And uh, you're experiencing this body. This body in your ascension process it's gonna change its structure it's gonna change and uh, it's gonna move back to to your true body slowly step after step um, you're gonna be experiencing changes in your DNA in your structure cellular structure in everything okay, in your mind uh, in all your states mm -mm. as you are experiencing this shift in consciousness and thus you are ascending in uh, the fifth dimension, okay? You're gonna experience massive changes in your whole system, emotional, mental, physical, astral. You're gonna experience massive shifts, okay? So, how can we speed up this divine timing of our spiritual awakening of the shift in consciousness? Because now, it is actually, um, we are actually moving to, to the end of time. Okay, we are in the end game, we are in the apocalypse, uh, and uh, we have to, each one of us has to play the game right. Okay, has to play his true, authentic self, and uh, we have all together to unite to end this time dimension, to end our enemy, which is fear and time. Those are our two enemies, fear and time. But this world, actually, this world of illusion that uh, humanity co is co-creating now through the egoistic thinking level consciousness which, I, which is the matrix, the ego matrix consciousness okay so we have to get out of this uh, uh, illusion, out of this uh, mental trap and out of this um, labyrinth of uh, um, our separation from God, our separation from ourselves which is, which is consciousness and stop identifying with this mind and this um, Ah, uh, body. Okay, because if we do so, we are trapped forever in this material world, in this uh, illusion, and uh, of course we, we are all gonna suffer. Nobody passes this world, this 3D world, <laughs> this 3D ego consciousness without suffering, of course. Nobody passes through that world with, uh, without experiencing suffering. So, um, the key here, the only time-tested uh, way to become accident-prone to a spiritual awakening because uh, it's, it mostly happens by accident, okay? You, you cannot think your way there, obviously, because the thinking is actually the illusion that uh, creates uh, this time dimension, this, this, um, this matrix. Okay, that name they gave you, that story they told you, that level of consciousness, which is the thinking, okay? So, we have to really uh, realize that the only time-tested way to uh, speed up this divine process and remember our wholeness is uh, to tap into the dimension of being inside us, okay? In other words, we have to take all the attention from the thing mind and the emotional body from the mind and put it all into the observer of our thing mind inside us, into that part of ourselves that is aware that we are thinking. For example, you say that you overthink. Okay, there is an awareness there. Pay attention to that awareness, to that part within yourself that says, that is aware actually, that you overthink. Okay, what is that? That is you, consciousness, that is your true self. In other words, take all your attention from uh, the material world, from your thoughts, from emotions, and from time. Take it all and you are that, you are pure consciousness. All the attention is back to the noticer, back to the observer of the thinking mind. And that is you, consciousness. So, the only, when you are there, when you experience uh, 
the dimension of stillness. It's actually, it is not stillness, it is actually, it is actually dynamic stillness. It is actually movement and stillness united and united as one. It, it is a movement and, you know, it is the dimension where stillness and movement co-creating oneness. That's all it is. It's a dynamic stillness, a moving stillness. Okay. And of course, that's the true gold. And uh, you have to really remind yourselves in this uh, situation. You have to really, to really remind yourselves that um, it's not something that you you have to achieve, because the ego mind, you know, it will try to persuade you to make stories to attach yourself to it, to make you attach yourself to it, your consciousness, I repeat that. The ego mind is going to try to make stories to, to make you think that uh, you have to achieve the fifth dimension state of consciousness, that there is something to achieve uh, in the future, you have to do this, you have to do that, uh, this, that, and that's the illusion, beautiful soul. That's the illusion, that's the system of control. That's the illusion. And uh, we have to remind ourselves that um, we have to overcome, we have to overcome this trap. Okay. We have to overcome this, uh, this trap. So, search for the, for the dimension of dynamic stillness. Okay. In the present moment, it, it exists in the timeless now, where past, present and future are happening at the same time and everything connects to everything else. Okay. That's the dimension of dynamic stillness, the dimension of being. Okay, the dimension where you enter with your pure consciousness, with your true self. That's your home, beautiful soul. You are trapped in this time dimension inside this body. That's your home. And uh, of course, uh, it exists now. If, if you let your ego to make a whole story around it, that it is something that you must achieve, you, you are gonna search for it in the future. You are still, you, you are gonna fall in the trap of the matrix. You are gonna move away from the eternal now, from the timeless. Okay, the truth of the matter is that uh, you are a multidimensional being living a human experience. The part of you, the small part of your uh, being that is trapped in this time dimension, experiences time, of course, but uh, time doesn't exist. That doesn't exist in the higher dimensions. Time is an illusion. Time is your prison. And of course, this part of you that is here is uh, necessary so this dimension can exist. Okay, so the moment of your spiritual awakening, I made a lot of videos uh, if you search uh, uh, about this. So the moment of your spiritual awakening is the moment you realize that you are a multidimensional being living a human experience and the small part of you is right here in this time dimension okay a small part of you and this small part of you is feeding this matrix it's like a battery feeding this uh, time dimension okay so we have to realize that uh, the, the only time testing way is to to, to speed up our uh, um, reconnection back to our true selves to our higher selves is uh, this uh, this uh, um, dimension of uh, dynamic stillness, this dimension of being, in other words. Okay, that's the only time tested way, beautiful soul. That's how you speed, that's how you speed the, um, the shifting consciousness, okay? That's the true meditation, actually. So, true meditation is being, and you don't do meditation. Okay, meditation, true meditation is being, okay? It's not something that uh, you have to achieve. These, these dimensions are all you. They already exist within you. The key is to tap into, and the, the only way to tap into and remember, remember your wholeness, is uh, 
The only time-tested way, actually, is to pay attention, remember, to pay attention with your mind to, to your true self, to your consciousness inside you, to that dimension of being inside you. Okay, and uh, of course, we live in the world of illusions. Look, look around you. Look around you. This is a matrix. <laughs> this is a matrix. This is a holographic um, simulation. Okay, you live in this world of illusions. Uh, and actually, if you are here, uh, most likely you have been sent here. Um, whereas um, most souls in this time dimension are trapped for eons in time. And uh, you are sent here to end this program, to end time, to end this version of the Matrix and uh, set those people free. And of course, uh, when we talk about people, we mean consciousness, the consciousness inside those people that have lost their way, that have forgotten who they are, okay, and what they are. And most likely, if you are in this transmission, it is because it is because you are part of this uh, team, um, which is uh, gonna bring the system consciousness and the end of time. And of course, the only way to do that is to change yourselves, okay? To remember your divinity, to become divine, to be a vessel for source, a vessel for God consciousness to manifest itself in this time dimension, okay? So, you have to remind yourselves that. Look, my beautiful, I love this, I love this. Ooh. I love this beautiful. So, this is a video, this is a video that uh, I, I really have to point out here in order to help you remember your wholeness and how to move in this world of illusions because actually everything is an illusion okay this is the separation from ourselves this uh, uh, time dimension this world is gonna change forever guys and if you're gonna be part of the solution you have to transcend the ego you have to shift your consciousness but uh, the only way to do that is through being through following your intuition and through following your heart. Okay, that's all guys, that's all. That's all you have to do. Follow your heart, follow your intuition and uh, enter the dimension of stillness, being, pay the attention and pay the attention with uh, the thing in mind to the observer inside you and experience life through this dimension step by step you'll see you'll reconnect with the truth of who you are with the knower in you with your multi-dimensional selves and when this shift on consciousness um, happens you'll see that there's gonna be a massive change in your life internally something has changed it's a fundamental so huge change it's um it's uh it's gonna be a huge change you're gonna notice it for sure it's actually whole shift in, in uh, the way you experience this world and because that's what it is and uh, remind yourself that um, the truth about this matrix about this uh, 3d and 4d reality because that is the matrix is to reconnect back with your consciousness that's how you beat this uh, time dimension reconnect back with your soul with consciousness with your true self okay and remind yourselves that uh, the only way out is in. But at the same time, now you're gonna see in the mirror of your life, in the mirror reflection in this illusion world, you're gonna see us, you, consciousness. You're gonna see pointers that are gonna make you remember who you are, even in the world out there, because we are setting. Humanity is a setting eventually. So, with that being said, I'm gonna enjoy my, my trip in nature i'm gonna relax a bit uh, get some oxygen and praise the sun coach oh my god i've been injured for like uh, one um, a week and I, I still can't do bicycle but uh, because the wood is directly in the knee i can't it's exactly where i where where the where i can do bicycle but it's okay it's okay so with that being said when this here make sure you share this video everywhere Make sure you follow on TikTok, Instagram, and um, my site where you can find uh, powerful information to remember your wholeness. And uh, yeah, see ya in the future.